Hello, welcome, welcome back to A Day Full of Budgets. Um, happy limbo week <laughs> that we're all in. Um, it is New Year's Eve um, and I'm doing my last check-in for 2023 before I count up my binders and restuff for the brand new year. Um, I hope you're all well. I'm, I'm going to get stuck into it today because I want to just go through what we briefly spent over the last week. I've got some money left from food shopping and I'm going to reallocate my knockout nine just so we've got a fresh start for 2024. Right, let's get going. So the sun has just decided to come out. Um, it's now blinding my eyes. So I'm just going to pull this up and I'm going to take my watch off because um, it annoys me uh, when I've rolled my sleeves up. So let's get started. Um, we'll start with the placeholders before we do this. Um, so food, I had £118 to spend this week um, and I've spent £70. Um, so £45 um, I've drawn out in cash. Um, I've got a £3 buffer just sat in the account um, because we've overspent so much in the build up to Christmas that we've just been eating all the leftovers. Um, so I'm really pleased with that. Um, fuel and charging. Uh, we have gone over just from an unexpected trip um, I took to um, Cambridge. So I'm just going to take that out. Um, it's only over by like £7, so I'm okay with that. Family fun, we have spent a little bit in here. Um, the children wanted to go and spend some of their Christmas money, so we went to a retail park and then we went and got some bacon rolls, um, which was lush. Uh, so there's actually £15 left in my digital family fund. This is one that will go to cash, um, but I will keep uh, digital bits um, going as well. Um, and then my self-care, I ordered from Etsy and I'm not even sorry about it. Um, I bought the annual challenge uh, from Budget Bashar. So, and then... Um, I also spent a little bit of my money when I went to Cambridge. So I've got a tenner left. Um, well, just under ten, £9, but I'll just stick this in. Again, this is going to, uh, to cash, but I will be I'll be doing both for mine because I have a couple of appointments that I have to pay for um, via the bank. <clears throat> money for us is empty, schools not used, clothes. We went and done the next sale. Honestly, that place is just brutal. <laughs> if you ever do, if you ever, are you a next sale person? I mean, I've done it on Boxing Day before and oh my God, it's just crazy. Um, I spent my voucher that I got for my birthday in September um, and then I got an outfit for my daughter. Uh, so I've gone over by £12, which isn't the end of the world. Um, it's fine. Got a couple of nice outfits each. Um, health and beauty. Uh, I have spent in here. I've spent a fiver in here. I've got a cold sore. I mean, this is probably TMI, but you know, we all like to share in this community. Um, I haven't had one for years, um, and it's horrific. Um, so I went and got some of those. Um, is it Comstead Comseed? Um, like patches that go over it. Anyway, really boring home uh, we didn't spend anything kids i have spent 20 pounds there's a whole saga behind why i spent 20 pounds but um yeah you don't really need to know <laughs> it's quite boring um just over bad gifting from relatives anyway it's 45 pounds in there it's fine and we spent nothing from clubs That's we have been in all week long. It has been lush. Um, pets, nothing either. School food, nothing. And bus passes, nothing. That'll all be next week. So that's that. Um, and the only other place that we spent from was Christmas. But there's nothing in the binder anyway. Um, and that's just because my husband secretly went and um, got some got something made for me. Um which I 
absolutely love so he has been forgiven <laughs> um so that's just going to come out of kind of next week's um monies so now we get to pay play with the cash so i've got a random pound here um i sold some wellies on um like facebook marketplace um, but she gave me it in two pound coins and a pound coin now i have a jar still i don't know if anybody's seen have i shown you this jar i don't know i've just wobbled it the camera so i've got one of these jars um and i reuse whoa, sorry for the noise i reuse mine by cutting the bottom and then sticking it back up and this is our two pound coin jar so we always save two pound coins in this jar i've done it for years um, and then it, it's not our shopping fund, it's our holiday fund. Um, so when we go on holiday in February, I will be opening this. Um, and then that's just a top up to our spending money. So the two pound coins went in that. And then I've got the rogue coin left. So we've got 45 pounds from um, leftover from food so we've got 10 20 30 35 40 45 and then an extra pound um i'll do that reallocation later just i know exactly where that's going to go um so we're going to do the fun money first um where shall i start um let's start in here i think oh and i've also launched um a new product that we have made um i'll take it out so you can see this is just a duff version because I like to use them all. Um, but the background is like a blue and marble effect um, with sort of purple and blue writing. And you save uh, the value of each letter as it is in the alphabet. Um, and it saves £195. Eat, sleep, save, repeat, because that's what we do. Um, oh, God, you can see the sun reflection. Um, anyway, it's live on our Etsy store. Um, and I love it. Um, do I start it today? Why not? Let's do it. Um, and shall I colour it in? Oh, I hadn't actually thought about this. So let's just put five in for the E. What shall I do? Shall I colour it in? Or will it take a while? Whoa, that's horrific. Because I'm not holding the pen properly. Let's do this properly. If I'm going to colour it in, let's colour it in. So, there we go. I've been wanting to, to do this one for ages. So, there we go. So, the first five is done. I'm, I'm going to leave that out to dry because that's a lot of ink. So, we're going to put £5 into here. Uh, where's the lie? Let's try this one. I haven't done the scratch off for ages. So uh, this is from Mama Needs, Needs a Plan. And I always get really confused <laughs> over um, whether I need to put the five pounds in or not. Um, so I might need to think about it. Hold on. Um, oh, I haven't got a bin. Uh, hold on. Let me just come up the table next to me. Just doesn't... Oof, now I've just thrown it on the floor. Oh my god. See, this I am such a klutz. I'm such a klutz. Did I tell you? Oh, I probably didn't. Um on Christmas Day. Was it Christmas Eve? Fortunately we'd finished food, but I knocked, I had a wine glass full of um like flavoured water and I knocked it and it went all over my son's plate, all over my, all over my son. Fortunately he's a fast eater and had finished, but that's how much of a klutz I am. I do it all the time. Okay, anyway. I digress. So I've lived in my house for 10 years. That is a lie because I haven't lived in my house for 10 years. I have lived in my house um, for eight years. Eight years? Yeah. Eight years I've been in this particular house. Um, so I am going to put five pounds in. So that's a lie. I haven't lived in my house. I'm, am I doing it the right way around? I'm pretty sure I have. Anyway, I'm sticking a fibre in. I do love this because it really makes me think. I love it. Right. 
Um, and then I need to put some money into this score a goal challenge, which is on our Etsy store, um, just because my son is going to need football boots very imminently. I don't know what that is on there. So the big balls are worth five pounds. So I'm just going to put five in. Normally I just use my change, um, but he will need them. So oh, I'm using up all my fives. Is that a good thing? I don't know. I don't know. Um, I might just swap these two. Am I even in shop? I haven't even looked. There we go. I'm going to take those two fives out. Oh, that is a manky £10. And put that in there. Um, I'm also going to leave this out just because it's a lot of ink. Um, oh, and then we're going to start the January challenge. Ooh, actually, I need to take all of these out. So I've, I've done all the others. I've done May and June as well. So let's start with what have we got? I think I might start with five. Yeah, look. Oh, Happy New Year. Here we go. Oh, and I'm just, I'm now, oh, I'm obviously colouring in the circles. Not quite sure why I've done that, but there you go. Uh, so let's put a five in here. Yeah, not quite sure why i just done a really, really bad circle. But anyway, these are so cool. So this one saves £70. I'm going to leave that out as well. <laughs> I've got all these challenges all over the desk. Uh, right, that's good. Um, and actually, what I forgot to get out is my... Oh, have I just knocked you again? Sorry if I did. Um, my Freedom Binder. Um, so I'm going to start this again. So whenever I have extra cash, um, some of it goes in here. So, oh, first one is £5. So I'm going to put £5 into my Freedom Binder. Um, and I'd like this to be saved by September for when our new mortgage rate comes in. Um, and then that will help towards that. So that is good. And now I have £21 left and a very messy desk. Um, I want to have it. Oh, ooh, exciting. So I want to start this, Save the Colour from Budget with Shea. Um, just because I've got, I love a nut dice challenge. Ooh. So I've just ripped my fingernail again. Need to plaster it. Right, so we've got two dice. So what we have to do is the six-sided dice will decide which set we um, are going from and then the coloured dice will tell us how much within that set we need to save. Um, now this saves £234. She has different variations and the highest amount is £12, um, which is great. I didn't go for the high one because I don't usually use that much cash. So... So we have set two and pink. So that's seven pounds, which I don't have. Um, okay, let me make change. I did not think this through. <laughs> well done. Oh, and now I'm being really cat handed with this. So one, two, three, four, five. Five is 10. Pop that in there. Right, now we can. Okay, so we're doing set two. There we go. So we're putting seven pounds in. Awesome. I was just tempted then actually to do another one, um, but I don't think I will. Ooh. Oh, I like that one. Um, and I haven't got any of the dice out. So I've got £14 left. Um, and I'm actually, because I haven't got all my dice out, I'm just going to put it into here. Shall I? Right, sorry about the uh, little interruption there. Um, my son, who was out on a bike ride, has, with a friend, have, they've decided it's way too cold. <laughs> so they've come back. Um, and they were clamping, cl clattering around and making so much noise. Anyway, what was I doing? So I've got £14 left. Haven't got my dice out. So um, I'm going to put £8 in here. Am I? 
Yes, I'm going to put eight pounds in here. Um, so I'm going to put 10 in and I'm going to take two out. And this is totally cheating. I haven't got my dice. Um, and actually, I should have just gone and got my dice, shouldn't I? Because I just got up anyway. I didn't. So, oh, let's pop this Sudoku roll away. And then um, I'm going to add some in my save seven with seven. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six. And I'm going to do... Do you know what? I really want to work on this smaller ones and then I can feed that into the bigger ones. Um, so we've got one, two, three, four, five, six. So we're going to do um, uh, two, four, five, six. So we're going to do these ones. One, there we go. And put all six in here. Which has got way too many coins now, but never mind. Can sort them out later right so that's the 46 pounds um put away um and now i'm just going to reallocate my knockout nine so i can start it again in the new year because i absolutely love it so we have got let's put that over there so we should have 123 pounds um so we've got 20 40 60 80 1 10 20 and 3 um Right, so this is going to two places. Just move that to one side. Uh, first place it's going to go now, I can't remember where it is. Uh, I think it's in here. Yeah, so it's going to holidays. Uh, so we have a ski trip to Norway in February half term, um, and I need five and a half thousand. So I've already filled out the tracker for the five. I've spent £500 on the deposit. I've got £4,800 left and I'm going to add £100 in there today. So 20, 40, 60, 81. Um, do you know what? Actually, I'm going to swap those out because I'm going to bank it. So, yeah, I've got 4800 4820 40 60 80 99 so 4900 pound so i'm 100 pound away from fully funding the holiday um which is fantastic um and then what i need to do is i need to save 380 pounds for the hotel and parking the night before and then a thousand pounds towards our spending money so we've still got a little way to go um but we are definitely on the right track. Um, and then the what I wanted to do is this £23 is go back into this binder. Actually, let's put all of these away now because they'll be dry. So again, this is uh, on my Etsy store. Uh, and it comes laminated or not laminated, but it's up to you. Oh, God, I can't get in here. Okay. So that's that one and then I'll put score a goal in as well which just saves 40 pounds uh, what was this one ah, here we go and then we've got the January challenge which isn't going towards anything in particular um it's just good to have a buffer at the end of the month um, to go towards whatever we need it to um, but this 23 pounds is going into my uh, 2024 challenge um, because this is saving for Christmas uh, next year so I'm going to add 20 into so 20 40 50 60 70 80 80 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 88 for Christmas 2024 which is a really good start um, happy with that so we're gonna color in not that one what have i just done with it here it is is this is the wrong color just color in the 23 there we go so that's four boxes and four larger um boxes done um on this 
challenge so that's great so i'm hoping to get kind of one box done a quarter um yeah i don't actually know what each box um adds up to but i think it looks roughly the same so that is my uh, check-in for week four um i have stuffed my leftover food money and reallocated my rock paper scissors into holiday and christmas uh, so there we go right thank you so much um for watching today um i really really do appreciate it um i would love to reach 500 subscribers um so if you're not already subscribed please consider doing it um like the video and leave me a comment about your uh, new year plans and i will see you all very soon bye